I'm happy to report that uh, the J Senate Judiciary Committee this week approved a bill that I co-authored with Senator Jim Merritt of Indianapolis, uh, which would afford uh, immunity to the caller in a situation where em emergency medical service is required for particularly young people uh, who are who are, are engaging in underage drinking. Uh, we know that uh, this is a growing problem around the nation. We want to make sure that, that young people receive the emergency medical service first. And uh, IU and other universities around the country have uh, passed uh, similar rules or regulations on campus, but this bill would, uh, the, if it becomes law, would apply statewide. So in 2009, there were 200,000 cases uh, around the nation of young people who had to receive emergency medical services at hospitals and other emergency facilities. Uh, and since then, 12 states have adopted similar legislation. So. Of course, the immunity only applies to alcohol offenses and only specific alcohol offenses at that. So it doesn't include uh, drunk driving or any of those kinds of offenses that might harm someone else. What we're trying to get at is providing medical services to, to particularly young people when they need it the most. And then we'll sort through the legal issues later.